What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2022 Panini Immaculate Collegiate Football just sold out. Brand new release today. This is a one box break, random number block number one. As you can see, number two is already on the website. And this is a random number block, guys. So everybody gets a random number from zero through nine. We go by the first number on the left side of certain number dash. And there's your examples down there. Remember, any and all redemptions go to spot zero. Any one ones go to spot one. Start off with Chris, end it with Aaron. Last mile mojo, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Excuse me. Now let's switch scenes and uh, roll the dice. And it is a two and a four six times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Aaron down to Terry. All right, six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six times, six, 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 three, down to six. All right, so Aaron, you have spot three, two, Andy. Any uh, redemptions will be yours. Terry with seven, Chris with four, five, eight, nine. Aaron, any one on ones will be yours, and Terry with six. So, don't think there'll be any trades, but uh, let me quickly just title this page and everything, and then uh, we'll start this right now. Remember, the next one is in the store, so if you guys do like this, we can always run it back again. The one boxer route is a little bit cheaper, so definitely, like I said, you can always get yourself a new pair of numbers in a one boxer, you know, instead of like a whole case where you might be stuck with it. It could be a good thing, right? You get stuck with zero or one or... You know, obviously, for some people that don't like the other numbers, minus those, I guess the one box breaks, I think sometimes work a little bit better, and they'll sell much quicker probably too. But uh, there's your names right there. Let's let's just print a rip, right? right? All right. So it is a full, or it is or it is a fresh case, I should say. Look at this. This is like the first time they actually made like brown. Like a little coffee. A little coffee color. I guess I do gotta switch it up every once in a while, right? One, two, three, four, five. Let's uh, see if we can get a little, little dice roll. If I roll anything but a six, we'll re-roll it again. If I roll a, if I roll a six, we'll re-roll it again, I should say, sorry. Okay, let's do it again. <laughs> five. So there you go. One, two, three, four, five. So these right here will be for the one boxers. Let me also X these. So that way you guys know they're from the same case. And again, we can run these back as well, guys. However many times you guys want. Like I said, only six cards, guys, so it'll be pretty fast, pretty quick. But some people should get some nice stuff, though. All right, first one is Quentin Nelson. That is uh, 46 out of 75. All right, that's a six, right? Yeah, 46. So that is uh, spot six going to Terry. And then our first autograph is Charles Rambo, or Charleston Rambo, 35 out of 99. Spot five going to Chris Maxwell. Probably one of the worst autos I've seen too. And Brett Favre, not in good standings with a lot of people right now, but still is a Brett Favre though. Nine out of ten, Chris Maxwell, with that. 
from seven miss. And how about a little RPA for my Eagles? But this is going to go random number block style. Number four. That is four out of 49 to Kobe Dean. I don't know. I feel like a lot of people that have gone to jail have been like, you know, obviously, you know, famously like murderers slash obviously like DUI kind of deals. I don't know. When was the last time a, f a famous like athlete would go to jail for something like what he did? <laughs> I mean, at least I don't remember. All right, so there you go. That is uh, four, Chris Maxwell. But yeah, I don't think he'll go to jail either, honestly. But oh, that's well. See, that's what I'm saying. But that's like murder, right? Oh no, actually, I think he was stealing, but literally stealing back his own stuff. And how about a Sam Howe? Nice three-color patch and autograph. He actually played really well in preseason. You know, I kind of thought, man, if Carson Wentz doesn't play well, this guy's going to actually play eventually. But, you know, although Carson Wentz had a little trouble with my Eagles this past weekend, you know, the first two weeks, he actually hasn't played that bad. And still, injuries was always his problem. He's been relatively healthy the last three years, so that's pretty good. But maybe something for the future for this guy. Uh, six is going to Terry. And... Uh, how about his receiver, Jahan Dotson? That is 76 out of 84. Looks like a piece of the glove. And that is uh, 86 out of 84, or 76, sorry. Another one for spot six. Killed it, Terry. Congrats, man. So Terry definitely got some good stuff right there. And again, guys, just like that, I know, I know it's kind of sucks. It's only one box, but like I say, if you do get the right number, you will definitely get some nice hits. And uh, there you go. I know, Aaron. I'm sorry, buddy. I was really hoping for a one-on-one -on -one for you too, man. Last ball, Mojo, and all, but we'll get them next time, man. We definitely will come back around. The hits come and go around. All right, well, guys, I appreciate it. Again, uh, this was just one box. Really nice stuff here to start off. Again, you're going to see a good mix of older veteran collegiate legends, and you're going to see a good mix, of course, of new rookies, but some nice stuff, guys. Uh, I would definitely love to do more of this. You know, we've only done one box out of the five so far. There's definitely some good stuff hiding here, including one-on-ones, beautiful patches and stuff like that, so I would definitely love to get more in. Uh, Jaspiescasebreaks.com, guys. Coming up next is Elements Football, though, which is another new release.